Well, thank you for having me. To tell you the truth, I didn't think you'd be calling me back at town. God, it's been like a month or something since I applied on this. It's a good thing I'm still interested in it, eh, boy? You mustn't be that desperate, are you? Why am I interested in the job? Well, I tell you now, there wasn't much to be posted to begin with, so I had to apply on something, see? And I'm stuck in the house with the husband. He got me drove cracked. So I said, if I can get something now, a couple of days at the week. That's all you're looking for, right? Yeah, well, if I can find something a couple of days at the week, that'll be fine and dandy. And I noticed that you're not paying very much. So I said, you know what? A little bit of money is better than nothing. But I don't know how often you give raises. Do you give raises like every couple of months or anything? Or once a year? Depending on how I'm doing. Well, I think so. I'm going to be all right. I don't think you're going to have no problems with me at all, see. Now, I'm not dead up on the fashions and everything and, and the clothes that people wear. It's like, I could barely fit in this jacket that I brought. But I said to the husband, you know what? i got to wear something nice to the interview. I can't just go in and look like a strail. So then he says, go into the closet now and see what you haven't worn in the last couple of years. So here I was in the closet this morning. My dear, this could barely fit on me. Look. Right? Too much COVID weight going on and everything. I didn't have the patience to be going out and buying something. So I said, I'm just going to have to shove on what I got and they see it. Right? I said, hopefully they don't notice that it's too small for me. But here I am telling you all about it anyways. How do I deal with what? The conflict? Well, my darling, I tell you, I deal with the conflict every day of my life. But you know something? The conflict now is not like the conflict that it used to be, see? My goodness, I remember there was time you give somebody a slap in the ass and that's it, that's be done with it. But you can't do that this day and age, you'll be up on changes. Honest to God, I don't even know how people deal with the conflict this day and age, see? Sure, everybody's very sensitive about everything, you can't say nothing, nobody. I'd say what you're better off doing is going in, doing your work, shutting up, and going home at the end of the day. There you go. Oh, well, that's it. Oh, my goodness, sure, it's not too that. The husband then goes and says to me, you're going to have some hard time with any interviews. He said, good luck to you. Right? He says, it's been dark since so you did an interview. And I said, well, I'm gonna hopefully going to fool you now. So what do you think you're going to be calling? Oh, well, that's not too bad. At least it's not as long as when you call me for the interview. Yeah, yeah I noticed that there was somebody that was uh, came in there about 10 minutes ago in the waiting room out there. Yeah, they must be doing an interview too, eh? Oh, well, they don't look like they got much experience at all. They don't look very old. Well, it was nice meeting you all, and hopefully I'll be seeing you now down the road.